Hey everyone, I'm Nog and welcome back to Satisfactory. Today is a great day because in between episodes I have crafted some, uh, where are they? Encased beams, encased industrial beams they're called. And we are going to upgrade our miners to Mach 2. And we are also going to double our uh, amount of coal plants, which is the first thing we'll do because I am sure that Mach 2 miners use more powers power than Mach 1 and uh, we are actually uh, using quite a bit of our power so there is a real danger that it might spike up and spend over 300 and everything will shut down so yeah so first things first we need to expand our uh, what's it called our foundation here uh, so that we can get more uh, coal plants going. So we are going to put foundations on 10 and we are going to get them set up. And I'm going to move all the way down here. Actually we need to... can I just take those? Yeah. So let's get some foundations going. There. Uh, we need, we do need to get rid of this. I don't like having stuff inside my foundations. It looks weird. So let's run down to the other end here. There, I think we need one more row, maybe even two. And to do that, we are going to need to equip our chainsaw and get rid of this thing. There. Let's unequip it. And get the rest of the foundations built. one I think this will do it uh, maybe not I think we'll build one more just for good measure yeah. let's back down this way Just had enough concrete to get them all done. Excellent. So what do we need to make our coal generators? That's not too bad. Uh, and I want them lined up like the others. So where's the first one? It's there. Uh, I think in from the side one two maybe three I think three probably and let's build it see so we will need to build one more foundation but uh, that's fine for now so one is did we leave a space in between I don't think we did maybe we did I think we left one space actually have two spaces. This will be fine. Now we just left the one. Excellent. So that's set up. Then we just need to get the coal out here. And is this uh, mark one? Who does this? Mark? 
one so let's just upgrade the ones on the main line to mark two like so oh there's the truck oh it's going along faster now on these and what we can do is just pull out from here i think and come over like right around here and then set up some splitters uh, this is not at all lined up we are one off now we can line it up with that splitter so let's do that where or with that uh, This is a bit hard. I think it's there. Let's see, no, it's not. It's there. Yeah. Well, then we need splitters this way. Stick it there. And we need to set up the rest of the coal generators. I am fairly certain that we left one. That really lined up. No, it's not. Oh, it's the other way around. Coal generator. There. 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 One, two, three, four, five, and six. Right. Two, three, five. No, I cannot count whatsoever. There. All right. So that's six more coal plants. Then we just need the splitters. Right there. That one doesn't need a splitter. Right there. Right there. And that's all the splitters that we need. So let's get these set up. It. Uh, let's see. Actually, I put Mark three belts on the uh, what's it called the hot bar because I was running around uh, upgrading belts to Mark three, but I had nowhere near enough steel. So I'm actually considering. Upgrading uh, on the steel beam production. Uh, we have one machine producing steel beams right now, which is nowhere near enough. I think uh, I want to get maybe two or three more uh, producing steel beams because we need so many of them. All right, and these are all my twos. Yeah. All right, so those are getting the full uh, now. Now we just need to power them, which we will do 
so. Like so. And like so. And I think we are bringing in enough coal to... Uh, to power them all. If not, then uh, we'll go upgrade on our coal production. But I do think that we are. Um, that's pretty nice. Let's see. We need to hook you up. To that. And to that. that. And then hook these guys up. Alright. So. That should be 300 more uh, megawatts of power that we are generating. Six hundred megawatts we now have, so that's a lot better, a lot better. But we are going to need more. There's no doubt in my mind. No doubt in my mind that we're going to need more. But for now, this works, and we are producing enough power. So let's uh, look at our miners and start upgrading them. So this is a Mark One miner. So tear that down and. Miner Mark 2. And of course the belt is in the way. So let's put the Miner Mark 2 on uh, zero now. There. And where did it go? Did it go around this way? Yes it did. Um, so that means that we are now producing 120 uh, or a minute uh, in that machine, which is fantastic. Uh, let's see, where do we have another... Iron miner over here. Then we need to take out this conveyor belt. And build a new miner mark two. Is it like that, I think. And get that going into there. And this needs to go. So this is a uh, this is great because we are going to producing be producing so much more ore. Uh, but right now we t we don't have the uh, the steel production to to actually take advantage of it because we can't produce enough uh, uh, what are they called Mark three uh, belts. But uh, we'll fix that. We go in there. We go in there. So we're basically doubling our iron ore production everywhere we are setting up my Mark II miners, which is fantastic. We also need it need to do it on this one back here. Yeah. Why am I missing a portable miner? Ah, because I didn't get it. Just crash that stuff and grab everything there. <clears throat> so 
so now we have it and we can get this thing going not that way you know mm. this way and hook that up and it's already marked two belts so that is great all right so we have upgraded one, two, three, four iron miners. This one is a Mark II, right? Yes. And we need to upgrade the one over here in the corner as well. Yeah. And disconnect that. There. And where did that go? I think it went. Did it go up here? I think it went up here. We're gonna say it went up there. Okay. So you can see up here, I've actually already upgraded it to uh, Mach 3 belt. But since it's not Mark III built all the way, it doesn't really matter that much that I've done it. Uh, I need so much more steel beams, or so many more steel beams, it's ridiculous. Uh, but this whole stack has been upgraded to Mark III. And all of the, the steel production area has been upgraded to Mark III. So that's good. But this should really help our uh, steel production or our iron production uh, as well uh, once we get the Mark III belts up and running. We just take a look up here. You can see that all of the belts up here are Mark III. Uh, it's a little bit hard to see because of all the splitters. But basically Everything has been upgraded to Mark III that needed need to be upgraded to Mark III. Oh, this is gonna hurt. Uh, let's just uh, see, do we have any? Yes. Just munch on those. All right. So, Mark III belts is the next big project. Uh, we still have some miners. We need to upgrade it. We need to upgrade our copper miners. Actually, let's go do that i have the materials to do it so let's just get it done uh, we don't have to worry about upgrading miners around here anymore then it's just down at the coal area that we need to upgrade them <coughs> excuse me uh let's get rid of some of this uh ore i don't need it There and pick this up and stick down a minor mark two. Ah. going now yes good oh power 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 don't forget the power i think i forgot it over on one of the iron miners i'll go fix that in a second So, was that right? I don't think that was right, but it'll work. Where does it go? Oh, it goes right there. Well, that's perfect. 
And this is already Mark II as well. Then it just needs power. Like so. Let's go fix the one miner. I forgot to hook up to power. I'm almost certain that I forgot to hook that one up to power. Yes, I did. So it's not going to be no use upgrading if we don't power the things also. All right. So Mark II miners are up and running, which is fantastic. And let's have a look at our power situation. It's not too bad. Not too bad. Right, let's go see how many steel beams we have now. Uh, I'm definitely setting up more uh, steel beam production because we need so many Mark III belts. So, and we have space for it. We can uh, set up uh, three or four actually uh, uh, assemblers or constructors over here making steel beams and just merge them onto to this belt. So let's see how many we have. 121. That's pitiful. That is pitiful. So let's see, uh, constructors, we have enough materials to make those. So let's see. What we can do here, we can set one up there, and there, and then we could set up one here, and here, and just hook these up. So uh, they're a little bit too close. So let's just set one up and make sure that it's not too close. And then we can set the rest up. I think here will probably work. Maybe. Uh, three. Nope. It needs to come out further. So, maybe on this one, it needs to be there, yeah. This work? This has to work. Yeah, no problem. Right, so, that's one. And we have room for one more here. And we have room for one there. And one there. All right. And let's get all of these hooked up and set up with power and everything so that we're producing some more steel beams. need to figure out where we're going to get the power from. Uh, where can we get some power? We can get some power from here. Uh, that's not going to be okay by me. So let's pick one there and hook it up over there. And then we need configure them for steel beams. And we need to get some output from them. Which will do this. Come up in a 90 degree angle. 
And then we need some mergers. Where's the... I think it's there. No, it's not. One closer. There, I guess. No, still one closer. There, that's right. So let's see. That's uh, how many do they produce? Ten per minute. So that's twenty, thirty, forty. So we actually just need mark one uh, belts all the way. Let's put the merger on seven. There, there, and then we need one on the top one, there, and then let's see, can it get up there, yes it can, And they are producing when they get enough steel. Which they are by no means getting. By no means. Because we don't have enough beams to make enough. Uh, Mark 3 belts. Let's uh, stick Mark 3 belts on 3 again. And let's just see how far we can get it. Uh, so it's done up until there. Right now steel is by far the most important because that is what will be holding us back. Oh, it's, uh, this is steel. Where, where did I lose steel? Uh, Dang it. I upgraded the wrong ones. All right. That's Mark 3. That's Mark 3. All right. But all of this actually doesn't matter until we get the uh, Mark III belt going to the uh, fr from the miners. But we have upgraded to Mark III all the way now for the output. So that's something. But look at that. There is absolutely no steel ingots coming down. Why are there no steel ingots coming down? Not a one. Uh, let's go figure that out. That seems a little bit weird. There's no ore on these things. Mm. The belt. So I guess I forgot to hook that machine up to power as well. Which would explain everything. There we go. And this is 120 belt all the way, yes. Mark 2 belt. And let's see where does 
Does it meet up with another machine so that we get up to 240? No, it doesn't. So we need another whoops, iron mining machines from somewhere. We need another we need another iron patch. But I think we're going to go look for that in the next episode. I just want to see that this is working. So let's see if some iron is going to come. I should. But I can't just stand there waiting. That's boring. Oh, there it comes. So we will start producing iron or steel ingots again, but we really do need to go find another uh, iron patch and get that hooked up so we double up on the production. Let's see, there's a ton over here this way, we know that. Seven hundred and fifty meters that way. So I guess we're going exploring over there next time. I need to find this truck and tell it to turn off its uh, nodes, its pathing, because it's a little bit annoying to look at. But okay, so next episode we will go uh, looking for iron over here. And I would actually really like to find some uh, catarium as well. Uh, because I would very much like blade runners and in order to get those we need Caterium but I have no idea where Caterium is around here so it might be a little bit hard to find it but we'll give it a try so next episode is going to be a bit of uh, exploring where we go looking for uh, more iron and some catarium. Are we starting to get steel ingots produced again? Can't see it. I hope so. Just run up and have a look to make sure. Because we need those steel beams to upgrade to Mark 3 belt, <clears throat> that's really, really important right now. In order to keep our production up. And yes, we are producing steel ingots. And let's just take a look from up here. Whoops. So yeah, but nowhere near as many as I would like, because we need more iron ore. So that's what we're going to do next episode, so thank you very much for watching guys, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, then uh, I would really appreciate it if you give it a thumbs up or a like, and if you did enjoy it also, why not subscribe so you don't miss out on the next videos. So I'll see you next time, and... Uh, have fun.